So, I want to talk to y'all today about uh, biblical movies. Now, I don't know if you guys are aware or have seen the commercials or whatnot. If you watch TV, maybe you have. I don't know. I haven't seen them. But uh, they're coming out with movies based on stories in the Bible. One of which being uh, the story about the uh, the story about Noah's Ark, the other one about Jesus's mother Mary. Um, so I think the G, the one about Mother Mary that one is from the same uh, producers who did the Passion of the Christ, which I did not see and still have yet to see. Uh, so. That I'm sure that will be interesting. Mm. Oh, excuse me. Can't wait to see what the critics have to say about that. But what I wanted to talk about and share my opinions on and thoughts is that, first of all, I want to say to these directors who are making these movies, fuck you, because y'all aren't really telling the story. You are omitting some important facts. Um... And I'm not going to support this movie, or any of these movies for that matter. Now, white people, I'm sure this may co this may come as a shock to you. Not I'm sure this might come as a shock to some of you. To some of you, maybe not. But as far as I know and have read up on, people back in the day were not the skin color of Russell Crowe. Uh, they was black. It was niggas back in the day. They were dark. Okay, I mean, if if they were of Russell color skin tone, please tell me, or Russell Crow skin tone, please tell me how their asses survived out in the blistering heat during that time. Because last time I checked, y'all peel and turn red when exposed to too much direct sunlight. Uh, and what pisses me off about these movies is that they habitually perpetuate the thought that everyone during that time was white or of a lighter skin tone when it's good and hell well known that pretty much all of life started from black man. So how did just all of a sudden in this, these Bible times White people just all of a sudden were, oh, we, we were the ones who were mainly up in the Bible. It just doesn't make sense to me. And it really irritates me because, for one, it's not really the white people who are the owners of these studio companies and these movie production companies. It's Jews. Jewish people. And for those of you who know your history, those people who claim to be Jews or like God's chosen people are actually not. So leave it to them. Of course, they're not going to be the ones to actually put the truth in the movie because they're the ones perpetuating the lie that people back in that time or God's chosen people, such as Noah, who built this ark, uh, were of European descent, which is bullshit because that for sure, for damn sure, is not how it went down. <laughs> so, to the movie companies and studios, fuck y'all, I won't be supporting your movie, and I will be telling everyone not to support that shit, because until y'all start telling the truth about the people in the Bible, and the people who were actually in these times, and stop picking these fucking random ass white people to play these roles, uh, I'm not supporting that shit, so you kiss my ass. Or not. But, uh, yeah. Black people, we was back in that time. And, uh, yeah. Fuck. Them trying to put Russell Crowe in. I don't know who the other girl is. She's, I forgot her name. I saw it on the website. But, anyway. Yeah. That's some bullshit. So, y'all need to start telling the truth, which I'm sure you're not. But, uh, until you do, I ain't supporting no biblical movies. That may sound harsh, but, whatever. The truth is the truth, and you may be able to lie to millions of audience viewers, but no, I'm not going to buy the lie. Not this time. So, anyway, Marcus Moments.
I just wanted to add this little quick PS for those people who are gonna, you know, talk shit and say, oh, why does it matter, like, what, what race people were in the Bible, you know, back in those times, and, you know, we're all God's children, and blah, 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 blah. Okay, well, for one, it does matter, because uh, look at any other race, white people, uh, Jewish, uh, Italian, everyone has a uh, historical pride in their race. They know where they came from, they know their lineage, they know all the history about their people and all that. And most of them probably learned it in school. But black people, and especially black people in America, don't know their full lineage. So to to me and to other to other black people who don't know, it should matter. Because this is our history. And I'm sure you white people don't want to hear that, but it is our history. And that's like taking uh, your fucking queen and making that bitch look like Aunt Jemima. Oh, this is, oh, this is your, your, uh, your queen. This is the queen who, whose history you come from. Aunt Jemima. Mm, yeah, I'm sure you white people wouldn't be too happy with that. But see, throughout the years, we don't, they've concealed the true identity of, one, the people in the Bible, and two, Jesus, you know, got everybody fucking praying to this white Jesus, all fucking, this long hair, look, fucking looking like a fucking grunge rocker, um, yeah, no, it matters, so don't come at me with that, well, why does it matter bullshit, because it matters, so, there.